Well, we turn to NASA now this evening, taking a victory lap tonight after one of its most impressive achievements. The Juno spacecraft is now in orbit around Jupiter after a journey of more than 1.7 billion miles that took five years to get there. But in spite of those staggering numbers, Juno arrived just one second off. Here's ABC's Clayton Sandell. NASA tonight is celebrating one of its biggest missions in years. <laughs> Juno signaling success with one tiny okay, click. We're in orbit. We conquered Jupiter. <laughs> 1.7 billion miles. And lift off. After blasting off in 2011. Jupiter itself is so big, 1,300 Earths could fit inside. Juno traveling 165,000 miles per hour, arriving just one second off schedule. You have to make the spacecraft smart enough to know how to handle itself. Juno hit a target so precise, engineers say it's like launching a golf ball from New York to L.A. and getting a hole in one. Juno was built here at Lockheed Martin near Denver. From this room, the team is sending and receiving messages to and from the spacecraft. But Jupiter is so far away, even traveling at the speed of light, those messages take 48 minutes just to travel one way. Soon, Juno will get down to the science. How did our solar system form? Where did we come from? What are we made out of? In 2018, Juno will crash into Jupiter, its mission at an end, but not before hopefully discovering new clues about how we began. Clayton Sandell, ABC News, Denver.